Today, let's create some designs with Adobe Express. To use Adobe Express, you just have to go to their website. Let's go to new.express.adobe.com and you're going to see a dashboard that looks like this. You can use it without creating an account, but you can also try the premium plan. The free plan includes a bunch of different options for your design, such as YouTube thumbnails, TikTok videos, Instagram posts, Instagram stories, cards, invitations, and much more. It also includes a bunch of features such as background remover, QR code generator, GIF converter, resizing images, edit PDF, and much more. With the free plan, Adobe also includes a bunch of different templates that you can use for different purposes, such as presentations, logos, Instagram stories, Instagram posts, or different social media posts, and much more. Let's create a YouTube thumbnail. So let's go to the search bar and we're gonna type YouTube thumbnail and it's gonna open the editor. First, I wanna change the background color. So in the top bar, let's click on background color and I'm gonna select this blue one. Then I wanna add an image. So on the left, let's click on upload and I'm gonna select the image I wanna add. And now let's edit this image. On the left, let's click on remove background and we can move it and change the size. We could also add some effects, animations, adjustments, change the opacity, and use the degenerative feel. There's also this other feature called Erase that is specifically to remove specific things or little things in the image. This is only available for the premium plan. Now I want to add an image to this background, so let's go to Media on the left, and let's type Adobe on the search bar to find a related image. And let's look for one that is available for the free plan. I'm gonna select this one. To add an image to your design, you just have to click it and drag it. Now let's change the size. And I'm gonna do a right click and I'm gonna select send to the back. Now let's change the opacity so you can see the color. Next, I wanna add some text. So on the left, let's click on text. And you can add your own text or you can select one of the pre-made templates. I'm just gonna select one of the pre-made templates. And same, you just have to click it and drag it. Now I'm gonna change this text and on the left you could change the font, the color, the size, the text layout, the thickness and more. I like this text so I'm gonna do a right click and I'm gonna select duplicate. On your left on the top you're gonna see some recommended pre-made templates. Let's look for one that looks good and I'm gonna select this and let's change the text. Now I wanna change the color and you can move the text separately or together. Let's move them together. And now I want to add an Adobe Express logo. So I'm going to go to upload and I'm going to upload a logo. I'm going to put it here and I want to remove the background. For this specific logo, it would have been better to use the erase feature because I could just remove the little white corners on the logo and it wouldn't have removed the entire black part, but it's only available for the premium plan. So I'm just going to use the remove background. And that's it. Now we have our YouTube thumbnail. To download your design, you'll have to go to the top right corner and click on download. It will give you different options. I'm just going to leave it on PNG and click on download. And that's it. We have our YouTube thumbnail with Adobe Express. If you want to see how another design tool works, you can check out our Canva tutorial for beginners right here.